modifying curtain system panels. We can modify the panels. By default, each one of these panels here, these rectangles, is considered a panel. And it's a self-contained curtain system panel. And by default, it's put in with a glazed system panel. Glazed means window. But we could put in there an empty or a solid panel. Uh, but we need to select uh, our panels and we might need the help of our filter tool to do that. So I can actually come in here and um, I can select on a few things and it's kind of difficult to select some things here and I can go up the filter and I say yeah I want just the panels not the grids. I can apply I can say okay but I'm gonna do it a little more efficiently here. I'm gonna hit escape and I'm gonna go to my front view here and even though I'm in 3D here, I could have went into my elevation if I want. All right, and now I'm going to come in here, and I'm going to window uh, uh, crossing across those panels there. I'm going to go up the filter, make sure I just have the curtain panels. Seven panels. Three, four, five, six, seven. Correct? Yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And I'm going to get rid of the wall grids. I'll hit apply. I'll hit OK you'll see down here it has multiple you'll see it goes to system panel glaze that means it's glass I'm gonna go down and I'm gonna change it to solid when I go to solid then I'm gonna click out of there and now I got a solid like a veneer stone and I'm gonna go back in here to my 3d look at it and I'm gonna come in here and look and you can see where it's a solid uh, material. I'm going to actually come in here and go to a more realistic look to it here. Right? And you can see where this is glass and this is a solid uh, material here. So we could have this being a, a, any kind of a siding material that we wanted, uh, such as a thin, uh, you know, uh, if you think of the North Extension Center, row 50 is a good example. Uh, so, uh, we can modify curtain panels, um, but we have to typically select the panel and go over to our type selector, and we might need to use the filter tool to help us out.